what's up guys i'm back with another video and today i've got an oldie but a goodie ozzy uh, spider-man spider cycle chase from the ultimate spider-man theme and uh man was i surprised when um, my parents showed me this and um yeah so i got it today it's 2021 and this is a 2013 set so this so i was really excited and uh, this is the first set to have Venom and Nick Fury. So that's also really, really cool. It's also, um, oh, for some reason, the back of the box. Sorry, that's my lightsabers. Uh, anyways, um, oh, there's the set. But it also has a comic book. And I won't show these, I'll be able to show these all the time for the old sets because I need to rebuild them, but today I uh, got one, so pretty cool seeing the Dr. Doom is missing, and I uh, was surprised they didn't cut to uh, different scenes for different sets, and they just like put them all together. It's kind of a cliffhanger right there, but that's where it ends, and then you can see the group shot that right there. Um, this set, even though it is, um, from 2013, which is a while ago, and they didn't have all the fancy new pieces that, um, we have, that LEGO has today, they, um, it, the set still had some pretty cool techniques and some technical pieces that you don't see too often. Um, and something that I thought was cool was they had this little group shot right there on the instructions. So now let's finally get into this and uh, start off with Venom's stuff. So he's got um, two identical builds for these symbiotes. Pretty simple builds, but pretty cool ones. You could stick them all over stuff, like Nick Fury's car and try to take it over, like they did with the, um, uh, the spider crawlers. Um, they had a minimized version of that, so that's cool. And then we've also got this spider bike, um, and that's all. It's like not um, uh, as bright as they make the Spider-Man vehicles today, which is I think actually a pretty cool thing. It makes it look cooler and more you know high tech, like from Shield, and. I like it. Um, it's got a sticker right there, and then it can transform into a hover bike. And keep in mind, this is also Spider-Man's first vehicle, so a lot of firsts in this set, which is very, very cool, um, for sure. He's got some handlebars as well, um, so he can fly around instead of swinging, but he does have a nice web, and there is an extra in the set for that piece. Um, they also suggest that you can wrap up Venom, but we'll get to the figures later. <coughs> Anyways, then here is the main build of the set, Nick Fury's car. If you look on the underside, it is pretty colorful, but once it's done, you're not going to look on the underside of this thing, because it's just too cool to flip it over. Um, so, yeah. It's got a Nice shield sticker right there. And then these are identical. So would have been cool if they had a little bit of variation between the two. But um, they're still nice license plates and buckled plates. And I think that's supposed to be a reference to something that happened in 1989. If you know what reference that is, please tell me in the comment section below. Because I don't get uh, every single reference. But I like the lights up here. I also like the lights at the back. So, um, this is actually cool how they clipped it in. I wasn't expecting that to make it kind of lower, um, the windshield. And then on the back, you've got a spoiler. So, it's like a Corvette or something. I don't know too much about cars, but yeah. We take Nick Fury out, we can get a better look at the inside. It's like a nice leather seat seating and then got two consoles which again I wasn't expecting for like 2013 
but of course there is the steering wheel because it, it has to be like um and it, I think in this case it is really um, good that there's a steering wheel because you know it is supposed to look like a normal car but of course it does transform like you um, might have seen on the box so you just push these tires down got a little bit of friction but you can do it and I like to angle them out a little bit um, to try to get that nice hover effect like back to the future style um, so that's cool, um, and speaking of Back to the Future, from my Gadget Mobile custom set, um, I found out that Santa, that Santa actually based that off of, uh, the DeLorean from Back to the Future, but uh, that's just a side note. Anyways, um, there is one other transformation feature in, on this car, and that is right here. It's pretty well hidden, although you can see a little bit of red through the seats there. But you just lift this up. This kind of acts as a nice handle to grip it, um, which I like. And you can lift it up, and you can spin this all the way, well, almost all the way around. You might be able to get that to the back. I don't know, but um, yeah, you can move this thing however you want. Get it a little closer. Right there, that's a pretty cool look. And it's just a flick fire missile. And I actually like the flick fire missiles even more than the stud shooters because the stud shooters get lost so easily. Although they have become a new standard. But I think the spring loaded, sh the spring -loaded shooters still work fine and don't get lost too easily. Anyways, you just push if you don't know how flick fire missiles work. If you're like a new Lego fan, just push it, and then it comes out. Oh, sorry, I knocked over my camera when I reached to get the uh, flip fire missile. Anyways, I'll get that later. Um, but yeah, um, up oh, here it is. There we go. Um. And they are easy to find, and um, they work pretty well. And you can get a little bit more force there. I just didn't want to get it lost behind my desk. Um, and then if you want to convert it back, like you just saw, you just push it back down. And then for these, they have some little levers which make it a little easier. Although... I mean, you can just push it in. That might be even easier, but I don't know. I think that might just might just have been for like structure or something of the mechanism. But it is a pretty simple mechanism. Anyways, um, now let's get into the figures, which are really cool parts of the set. So we'll start off with Spider-Man, and uh, take his web off. This is the classic Spider-Man, and in my opinion, this design doesn't actually get old, uh, it just gets repetitive, but I like it, and, um, you know, it's pretty simple, but still looks good. Definitely matches the show that it's based off of. Next up is Nick Fury, which I'm so happy to have, um, because of course he's the director of S.H.I.E.L.D., and, um, I actually really do like this, um, uniform, which is based off the comics, um, with the blue. But this is, of course, the Samuel Jackson, uh, face, which looks good. And he has a gun, so he can do some damage out, even out of his car. Um, so that's cool. And then here we have the now really really popular in Lego Venom um but in 2013 this guy was rare because he only came in this set although it is only 20 or it was only 20 or 30 dollars I think um back in 2013 but he has this cool um like symbiote growth behind him tentacles that are like 
and it's got the kind of spider design right there cool face and if you take off his assembly which just uses this rotating axle piece um, you can see the back front there um, continuing that kind of spider esque design uh, so that is all for this really cool set um, of course it might it might be hard to get your hands on now um, and I don't know my parents trick but um, it is still very cool and I think it's even cooler than um, the latest big spider-man set the, mon the monster truck because it just looks more futuristic because it's not so you know bright and there's nothing wrong with bright colors and vibrancy but like you know it's just that like a net shooter is the main function of it and it just doesn't really appeal to me over oh, this set has pretty cool colors I like the green um, and um, it has cool features like that I don't know when the last time they've done the hover thing I think that was 2017 um, you can correct me if I'm wrong but that's so uh, yeah so thank you for um, watching this video Tell me what you think about this um, old set in the comment section below, and I will see you guys next time. Spidey out.